Welcome to 12 News at 6.30. I'm Jade Belexa. And I'm meteorologist Jacob Lanier. Thanks for joining us. We're continuing the morning sip live in downtown Jackson at the King Edward Hotel uh, for Breast Cancer Awareness Month, Jade. Yeah, it's a great morning to be out and about. We can hear the birds chirping behind us. Yes. And we have our pink on to honor those who have lost their lives mm -hmm. and survivors out there. Yes, for sure. And we're hoping for a pink sunrise this morning. You can also already see a little bit of light behind us. 30 minutes now to sunrise. And our temperatures right now across the city sitting here in the 50s and 60s downtown Jackson at 61 degrees just had to check there on my Apple watch we got some upper 50s off towards the west but most of us this morning feeling pretty comfortable it is still humid this morning though as you step out the door you'll notice that so maybe you're heading to the state fairgrounds today it's Friday so a lot of folks are gonna head out there the gates opening at 11 so our temperatures going from the 80s at lunchtime to 87 degrees our high this afternoon and temperatures falling back into the 70s later on tonight with most the clear skies and I think the nice weather continues through the weekend folks just going to be warm out there I'll tell you yesterday I forecasted 86 degrees at the state fair and I was out there it felt hotter than 86 so you yeah. need the water bottle with that sun out there really heats I was things just up. chugging water bottles all I afternoon hope you, were. you need <laughs> yeah. to stay hydrated out yeah. there that goes for everyone mm -hmm. keep and that water bottle handy yes and so we've already talked this morning to Dr. Christy Haygood she's a gynecologic oncologist over at St. Dominic's and then we saw Stanley who's helping cancer patients save their hair during chemotherapy. Yeah, that was quite an incredible, incredible cap yep. that some patients had already worn and, and saved some of their hair. And people don't know about it, Jade. You know, who knew that you could wear a cap during chemotherapy and save 60% of your hair? Yes. I didn't know that until last week when we met Stanley. So we're really excited to share his story. And uh, we appreciate uh, all of your help uh, donating to our Real Men Wear Pink campaign. We're getting up there, Jade. We sure are. Chloe has the numbers <laughs> for us. Chloe, how are we doing? We are doing excellent. Right now, we're at 3,768. Our goal is 5,000. We got about 1,300 left. Come on, you guys, help us donate. This is all going towards a good cause.